For number 12, we are going to figure the value for log base 3 of 1 over 9. And this is how I want to show you guys on how to figure out the log values without a calculator. First, we have to know that this is just going to be a number, but unfortunately, we don't know what it is at the moment. So let me just say this is equal to some variable k. You can use x or y, doesn't matter. And then what we do next is, we pretend both sides are exponents. And then we look at, this is log with space 3. So what we do is, we take 3 raised to this exponent, and then we take 3 raised to this exponent. And the reason is because, when the base match, we can cancel out this 3 with log base 3. And then we will just get 1 over 9, and that's equal to 3 to the k's power. You see, this is how we change from a log equation into an exponent equation. Now we just have to figure out for what exponent k will make this equation true. And to do this, we look at 1 over 9, and we'll try to write that as 3 to some power. Let me show you. First, we look at the 9. 9 is the same as 3 times 3, which is 3 squared, right? So I can look at 1 over 9 as 1 over 3 squared, and then this is equal to 3 to the k's power. But then, the 3 to the second power, this is in the denominator. We don't want that. However, 1 over 3 to the second power, we can use negative exponent for this. This is the same as 3 to the negative 2 exponent. And then on the right hand side, we have this is equal to 3 to the k's power. As you can see on both sides, they both have a 3 as the base. And then for the power right here, it's negative 2. And then for the power right here, it's k. That means what? This means we must have k is equal to negative 2. And then what is k though? Refer back to the original. k is exactly what we're trying to find. k is log base 3 of 1 over 9. So we know this has to be negative 2. So this right here is what we're looking for. And this is answer choice A in the answer choices. That's it.